guys, well, <coughs> yo guys, what's up, welcome to another video. Okay, so in this one, you've already seen the title, you know what it's going to be. Right, so basically I got these wheels from AliExpress, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. And then I was thinking one day, hmm, they look like the front wheels of a Batman car. So that's what I'm going to do. Right, so just to put it into scale, um, this is a normal one tenth scale wheel. This is the wheel that I'm going to be using on this Batman car. So it's 160 millimeters diameter, uh, lots of millimeters wide, and yeah, it should be good. Right, so we're going to be making out of two old project cars. So we got this hoverboard powered drift car. So we're going to be taking this apart, using all the electronics from this and some of the steering mechanism. And also we got the back end of the hoverboard mobility scooter go kart, whatever it was. Um, we're going to be taking the hoverboard wheels off this. So, if we line them up, uh, proportions of the wheels, they seem pretty good uh, to, the, to the car that we're going to be making. So I think it's going to be alright. I mean, ideally these could have been a bit wider, but that's just what we got. Right, so what I'm going to do is take these apart, I'm going to make a new chassis out of this stuff, chuck it all back together, um, stick some electric on it, and then probably go out and test it and see if it works. Um, if it's alright and works, I might try and put some suspension on it, but for now, we're just going to be concentrating on trying to make something that works. All right, I'll catch you in a bit.
Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, dear. That was a big thing. Oh, you're not expecting this one. Oh, wow. <laughs> that new one? Yeah, I made it. Oh, it's taken a couple of days to do it. I know they had it done yesterday. Yeah. Wow. No, three problems. I don't know if it's going to work on that. That's his beach. Yeah, the steering's a little bit like a little bit wobbly. Hey. The steering's a bit shit, but yeah. See how it goes. Might be okay. Have to. Ah, uh, oh, you put your phone on it. Cool. Yeah, I just wanna. Okay. Oh, have you got like a speed controller app? I don't know, you see a speed on there. Oh, nice, okay. Just have to hope you don't flip it. Yeah. Ah, this isn't too, too bad. No way. That'd be funny. Did you get? Well, I think first it says 16 mile an hour. Okay. And then it said 8 mile an hour. Oh. Maybe it didn't actually. Okay, you probably got to keep it at a high speed for a long time for it to register. Yeah. There it goes, alright, doesn't it? Oh, good, isn't it? It's quiet as well. Yeah. I thought it'd be a bit noisy, didn't it? So 
Ah, oh, that's yeah. It probably makes it heavier and a bit slower, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Fine on the grass, isn't it? <laughs> I don't think it'd be that good. Just gotta make the steering a bit better because it's a bit shit. It doesn't turn very sharp. Yeah. Like, it takes half the skate park to turn around. But, I mean, going forward to backward, that's fine. Probably do with a bit of suspension as well. Yeah, I've got some. Um, got some uh, like little bike suspension about that big oh yeah so they might do it It's ready. Yeah, it's a good couple of days worth of building time. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Such freaking battery. Uh, it's a uh, 36 volts. Yeah. So what's that? 15. Um, I think it's 8s. I don't know. It's either 8s or 10s. That's a cute one. Oh, it's because it's um, it's got like a control loop on, on the steering, so this is like a potentiometer. Yeah. So it knows what position it's in. It's just trying to correct itself. But oh, see, it's got like a bit of play in it. Yeah. It, it's, it's like it, by the time it grips it, it's gone too far. Oh, right. So I need to, that, that's literally the thing I was waiting to print before I came out. Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah. Like I'll do another one tomorrow that will be a bit tighter. Yeah. And then it shouldn't do that as much then. And then also I've got to make these bolts a bit higher so that it can turn sharper. Did you buy the motherboard like that or did you make it home? What, the hoverboard? Motherboard. Oh, that? Yeah. Um, that's out of an old hoverboard. Oh, right. And then that's just a 3D printed box and then a laser cut acrylic one oh, on top. Right. Yeah. And then that's the same kind of box there. So that's got like, um, so that's 36 volts and then there's a 24 that, volt. Yeah. Is that two of the wheels you got? Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah, those yeah. Um, 160 from, ones. Where's that from? Um, these are off a hoverboard. Oh, right. Like an off road hoverboard. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's cool. And we got a 24 volt transformer there to do yeah. that, that motor, and then that power supply for that motor. And then in here, I've got um, like a microcontroller oh, that's yeah. doing the sending the signals to this thing and that thing. That's yeah. what all the wires are for. Uh huh. Wow, that's fucking cool. Yeah, it's cool. Took a while to do, like, but. Yeah. Still not finished yet. Like it's going to be that Batman car, so the, the oh, size yeah. the size is kind of right now. Oh yeah. Um, I just got to make a sort of body for it. Yeah. And probably make the front wheels a little bit closer together. Yeah, yeah. And then it should be good then. <laughs> Ready? Now try and get. I've thought about making something. Okay, what are you thinking of making? I don't know. How? How's your WL coming on? Oh, I'm just going to redo it. I'll redo that steering hole. Okay. That was a bit. Ah, fuck. <laughs> so it was all going. Now I'm a little sort of nerve. That isn't a thing for you to be here. <laughs> run it over. Try not to. I could be little Robin in this little car. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, Batman, I'm on my way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's funny. 
Right, I'm going to switch it off for a bit so I don't have to carry it home. Right, so that's it for part one. Most of the build's done. Uh, everything works okay. I've got to do a few improvements on the steering because that's a little bit wobbly and doesn't turn sharp enough. Um, apart from that, it all seems pretty good. So if you want to see the next bit where we start putting body panels on and maybe add some suspension, don't forget to like and subscribe. And that's it. Thanks for watching.